Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. We are at the post office right now. I need to ship out this package and I also need to check my P.O. box while I'm here. So about to go in here, it's crowded. The line is to the door, yeah. The line is to the door, so luckily I already have a shipping label for this thing. I'm just gonna drop it in the, um, in the little drop box, well the drop off area. So yeah, that's what we're doing. But yes girl, hey, welcome back. Um, if you guys are new, this is what we do on Sundays. We do these chill laid back vlogs. And then throughout the week, I upload my other content, which is tutorials, reviews, hauls, all of that good stuff. But yeah, welcome. Glad you guys are here. But let me do this and I will be right back. Where, oh, I was like, where are my keys? Girl, I don't forgot my mask. Hold on. <laughs> I forgot to get my mask. I'll be back. Okay. I'm back. I broke. I don't know how this happened, but. My key came off of my keychain. Um, yeah, so they are crowded today. Crowded. But I did what I need to do. Mm-hmm. Take this off. Okay. So right now I am there is this Starbucks drink that I want to try. I saw a picture on Instagram and it just looks so good. It's like a I'ma pull it up because I took a screenshot. It's like a refresher drink, but it has some type of sweet foam on it. Let me show you guys. Can y'all see that? Can y'all see? I mean, does that not look good? It's called the Ice Guava Passion Fruit Drink with Vanilla Sweet Cream Foam. I think that'll be a nice little drink to drink, you know? A nice little refresher drink with a little bit of sweetness to it. Cause I don't want all that sugar. So, yeah. We're gonna go try that drink. Hopefully they make it good, so let's go. Oh, update, you guys. Remember when I said in the other vlog, my last vlog, that I got a new mount for my car for this camera? I got this, and I can't even get it to stick. It sticks, I mean, I can get it to stick on the window, but the way my camera would be, like my camera would be upside down if it's stuck on the window. So I tried to stick it on my dashboard, and it doesn't like it doesn't stay so comment down below if you are a vlogger if you have a car mount I want to say girl I get everything from um, from watching Minna but I think she has this too but I want to like I want this to stick on top of my dashboard so my camera can be right here instead of having it flip because this does you can rotate this like this but still, even so, if I put it on my window, the camera's gonna be upside down. So yeah, I just wanted to sit straight up like this on my dashboard so the camera can be right here. But comment down below if you have a um, mount for your camera, and I use the Canon G7X. If you have a car mount, let me know which one it is. You know, give me the link, all that good stuff. And I'll link this one too if y'all are, you know, wanting to check this one out. But I mean, this is nice. If I can get this to stick, because it has like a little suction cup, but if I can get this to stick on my dashboard, I will be perfect because I really like how this is made. It's really sturdy. You can tighten this up too. 
honestly, I might get the double-sided sticky tape and just put it on here and then put it on my dashboard like that. But right now, I got you guys propped up. So if we start moving, the camera's gonna fall, but yeah, I used to vlog with my um, phone, but I like the, uh, the vlog footage with the camera better. So yeah, let's go. I don't want you guys to fall, but I mean, I would want you guys to ride with me, <laughs> you know? Choo, 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 choo. Okay, I'll see you guys at Starbucks. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, we got the drink. We got the drink. Let's, I'm gonna spit my gum off. Let's try it. strawberry cream saver uh, candies like a lifesaver back in the day that's exactly what this tastes like girl this is good this is good 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 oh this is good and it's not that sweet either which is perfect it's so good I should have took like a cute little ooh. Y'all don't fall. Oh, this is why I need a little mount. I should have took a cute little IG photo, but whatever. We'll do it next time because I'm gonna get another one next time. <laughs> y'all, look where we at. Look where we at, y'all. I'm telling you, I got a problem. I got a problem, but I need to go in here because I need to get some Benadryl. And Target is close, so we about to get some Benadryl for my allergies. So I did not do any damage. I got three things out of Target, just three things, y'all. So I did good. I did really, really, really good. Ugh, ugh. Why am I grunting so much? <laughs> but yes, girl, I did good. I'm gonna show y'all what I got. Let me show you what I got. So. Like I said, I went in there for Benadryl. Got me some more Benadryl. And I also, let me get some light up in here. It's dark. Can y'all see me? I also got, um, I wanted to get some more of this Maybelline concealer. Cause I ran out of this a long time ago and I never could find a shade. And I use the shade tan for my under eye highlight concealer. Um. Oh, it's hot. Let me take this off. Whew, it's hot with this mask on. But yeah, I ran out of this long time ago. Long time ago. Y'all remember when they came out with deeper shades? That's when I got one of these a while back. Look at me sweating, y'all. It's hot. Um, but yeah, I use the shade tan. It's the instant age rewind concealer. And then the last thing I got, I kind of sort of needed, kind of sort of didn't need, but I saw them and I thought they were cute. Y'all know how I am when I see cute things. With some new pens. Um, these are the pastel speckle gel ink pens. And I thought they were cute. They're cute. I wonder if they write. I didn't even read to see if they write. Okay, black ink, which we all need some black pens. So I'll keep one of these in my purse, keep one in my desk at home, and then, you know, just to have a good, nice black pen. And they were just cute, so I couldn't pass it up. But, oh, girl, it's hot. Let me turn my AC on and let's get home. Let's get home. actually need to do some work today um, so I'm gonna spend the rest of, of the day today to do work dang I had to leave this in here because I didn't want to take my mask off drink it take you know keep taking it off and drinking it while I was in Target but 
I'm actually almost done. The ice is probably watered this down. Mm, it's still good. I hate when I get ice in my mouth when I drink. Y'all gotta try this, this is good. It is delicious. Let's get home, girl. Hello, hello. Hold on, y'all. Let me get this right. Okay, so I am about to go have dinner with my girl, Faye. Y'all, when I say, I have not seen Faye in 50 years and we literally live like, well, I don't know now, she, she moved now, but um, we live without traffic, maybe like 30 minutes, 20 minutes. I'd say 20 minutes without traffic, depending on how fast we drive. But she and I are about to meet up and have a dinner downtown at Atlanta. And I touched up my makeup, so I've been filming all day long. So I've been in these hot lights all day. So I kind of touched up my makeup, just putting on a little setting powder where I need it. Kind of, uh, I put a little bit more bronzer on and I just put it right there on my nose because my nose started getting a little sweaty from the filming lights. But yes, girl, that is what we are about to do now. I'm about to actually head out the door because I typed in the address on my GPS from here. And girl, it says heavy traffic. So it's gonna take about an hour. But yeah, if you guys don't know Faye, she is also a YouTuber. I will have her channel down below in the description. Um, so yeah, we are about to catch up. We haven't seen each other in a while, so yeah. Y'all look at these shoes. Freaking Amazon. 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 And they're so comfortable. They have rubber on the bottom so you won't slip and slide while you're walking. But yeah, these are the shoes I'm gonna wear. And I just put, um, I switched out my bag to this one because I don't, I don't really have a black bag. And I wanted a black bag to, you know, go with this outfit. Are these not cute? So stinking cute and comfortable. Hello, hello, it's Sunday. So today's vlog is gonna have to be up like late, 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 late today because I'm getting ready to go to a Braves game. And yeah, I gotta put some sunscreen on my face. Um, I don't have anything on. I just got out the shower and I need to put something on my lips. But I just threw on a t-shirt that says black women deserve luxury. And I have some um, black biker shorts on and then I'm just gonna throw on my black um, sneakers. And that's it, like this is my casual look, y'all. <laughs> when I don't wanna do anything, this is literally what I do. Just throw on something super comfortable, throw on my long hair, put it in pigtails, and then throw on this hat, so. But yes, um, just wanted to say hey, even though I told you guys hey earlier in the vlog. But anyway, um, I don't know what time I'm gonna be back home, but. By the time I get back, I'll probably just insert this clip and then upload the vlog later on this evening. Um, but yes, girl, I'll see y'all later. Girl, guess what we about to do? I'm so nervous. <laughs> I wanna start getting more content on my Instagram um, and I slack so much on Instagram y'all like I just it uh, I just can't get it together <laughs> like one some days I'm really really consistent and then there are other days where I just don't have the energy to be completely honest like I just don't have the energy or I just don't feel inspired um, and I go through those phases like 
you know I can be so so consistent like for like two weeks straight <laughs> and then I just fall off <laughs> so I came to this really cute spot um, and I want to start getting like content photos over here um, not even just photos maybe just like cute little reels and cute little um, I don't know little videos stuff like that so that's what we're about to do girl like I'm so nervous I've never like taken like photos out in public by myself so that's what we're about to do <laughs> um yeah <laughs> so I got my tripod this I'm gonna do everything with my phone cuz girl I ain't got time for a camera I just do not have the patience to do these high quality professional photos if I ever do that, I'm gonna have a photographer do that. But right now, I am very content with using my phone. So we're gonna put my phone on my tripod. I have this little remote that came with the tripod. This is what I always use when I'm, well, if y'all see my reels and stuff, I'm always using this with it and I'm always using my phone. But yes, I'm gonna take y'all with me because I don't wanna be alone. <laughs> <laughs> as if y'all are here with me I mean the camera is here with me but I feel like you guys are here with me anyway so I want to do these photos on the steps because every time I ride by I'm like I want to take cute little casual photos in that area but the thing is the steps are like it's right where the road is like everybody's passing everybody can see me <laughs> so if you see me <laughs> just wave <laughs> but um I'm nervous it's hot I'm just gonna do a cat like a super duper because y'all know I like casual like that is me all day every day casual comfortable that's just me so I want to do um because I had this like little theme in mind I'm I, I don't know if I want to do it in this shirt or the shirt under it well obviously I'm gonna do it in the shirt under it because that makes the entire outfit so i have this cute little amazon set <sighs> i just be looking at people's pages and i'm like oh i want to do that it's so cute i love how she's outside i love how she's you know in coffee shops i love how just being out you know and taking cute content instead of being in a room you know so that's what we're about to do so let's go girl i am so freaking nervous but we're about to do it i'm about to take y'all with me got my little camera um tripod so y'all are gonna be there right with me y'all better not leave me do not leave me because <laughs> i am so so nervous but let's go y'all ah! y'all <gasps> okay so there <laughs> <laughs> Y'all don't think I'm so annoying, but um, there's like two families over here just chilling, and I'm so nervous. <laughs> like you would think I wouldn't be nervous for me to be like, you know, being a YouTuber, but like I said, I've never created content out in public, so oh, I'm so nervous, y'all. Like they're looking at me. I shouldn't even be breathing this hard. I'm done. If these don't come out good, <laughs> whatever, we tried. This is like a test run. If they came out good, of course, I'm gonna post it, but I think some of them look pretty cute. I can't really tell because I'm like directly in it. Look at the sweat, y'all. I am sweating. Huh, how do y'all do this? Um, but yeah, some of them look cute, I think. Ugh, I don't know. 
Let's go look at him in the car, y'all. I am out of breath because of the sun. Let's turn the AC on. Whew. Jesus. All right, let's look. Look at my face, y'all. Look at my face. I was out there for a good minute because I was trying to get like all the angles. Oh my gosh, look at my face. I was trying to get all the angles, girl. You know, you know. makeup off the glasses but oh my gosh look at my, if I blot my face it'll look like I just did my makeup but I'm not even gonna do all that because <sighs> I'm about to go home and take my face off and get in the shower but let's see what these pictures look like I'm gonna turn the AC Whew. turn the AC over here yes Yes. All right. Let's see what the pics look like now that I can really, really see. I really hope. Ooh. Okay, yeah, I could not see this out there. Out there, it looked really, really, really dark. But now that I see it, the lighting is perfect. Like, y'all probably can't, yeah, y'all can't see. It good but let me let me just go through them I'm gonna go through my first ones and see um, I was just doing like a little test run at first just to see if that was a good angle so these are not like serious photos with my um, t-shirt on and then I started going oh that's cute but I can't see that I'm wearing a two-piece it's just like it's cute though that's cute I might let me heart that one um these are cute some of them are cute the glasses oh that's cute <gasps> that one is so cute yo I'm excited I am excited y'all that is adorable okay heart that's cute that one about to be on the gram y'all this is adorable oh my gosh this is so cute that one's cute too okay Her okay at this point we are doing car vlogs because i feel like i'm always in the car when i um turn my camera on i'm filming on my phone today because i left my phone uh my camera at home so uh Oh, today's Saturday, by the way. I had to come to the hair. It's called Ultimate Beauty Supply. Because I need to get some hair. I'm going to get my hair braided. And I am very, very, very excited, you guys. Because I don't want to fool with my hair while I'm on vacation. So I might as well have it like in a protective style instead of um, getting a sew-in. So we're just going to get it braided, y'all. When I say I haven't had my, bra uh, my hair braided in years... It's been years, 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 y'all, since, I want to say sophomore year in college. It's been some years, but let's go in here and pick out the hair. I want to get, I don't know if I want to do straight or like wet and wavy braids. I don't know. I don't know, but we're about to go in here. Let's go in here, y'all. Let's go. Okay, I don't even know where to start, y'all. I don't know where to start. Like, I don't know where to start. I don't know. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and get a few packs of these. Comes in three, it says, pre-rinse and cleansed with vinegar wash. I am literally about to go to bed, y'all. Literally about to go to bed. I got y'all standing up here on this um, little tier that I have in my bathroom. But I figured I'd do my night skincare routine with y'all since I'm literally about to go to bed. And I'll show you guys like a more realistic nighttime. I haven't done a routine, a night routine um, in a good minute on my channel. So... 
I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all what like the products I use um, <clears throat> on my face because I know I've mentioned this um, a couple times in a few videos that I have actually downsized the amount of products that I use at night. So with that being said, I am going to show you guys these are my little skincare sleeves. So stuff won't drip on my pajamas. But yeah, let me show you what I'll be using y'all. Cause it's not a lot, like at all, not a lot. I'm gonna wet my face first before I even. Okay, so the cleanser. I'm using tonight is the Shani Darden um, cleansing serum and this is a really 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 gentle on the skin I just ran out of my um, I'm wetting this little sponge I like to use a sponge to wash my face at night but in the morning times I usually just use my hands to like quickly rinse my face but anyway yeah I just ran out of my Tata Harper clarifying cleanser this is like my 50th bottle <laughs> so I'm trying to use up my Shani Darden cleanser and you can get this from Sephora it is a black owned I'm gonna use two pumps of this and then I just wash my face with it this cleanser actually lathers up really, really fast if you just use your hands. Um, but with this sponge, it kind of takes a minute for it to get a good lather in. But I'm just going to wash my face with this. And I didn't wear any makeup today. Y'all saw that earlier today. I didn't have on any makeup. So. I like this thing because it exfoliates the skin too feels good put a little bit more water on it so I can get some more suds some more suds on the face there we go I like to get my forehead really good because this is actually this has become my problem area on my face up here on my forehead I don't know why but it's really sensitive up there and I break out so easily up there now I don't know why though and that's really why I've um you know went down to only a few products at night because I didn't really know what was causing like the little bitty tiny tiny bumps on my forehead so yeah, that's why I don't use as much product as I used to because I really wanted to see what was causing it. Because y'all know I like to test out products. I mean, this is what I do. Like, I review stuff for you guys. I test out a lot of products, um, which I love doing. But I definitely wanted to kind of just, you know, chill on a ton of skincare products and just really use what I know is good for my skin like the products that I use constantly products that I repurchase constantly so that's what I'm really um focusing on right now I've been washing my face for what <laughs> girl it's time to rinse this off I've just been scrubbing the face and talking but let me rinse this off y'all I love this sponge and I don't use this, um, I don't use this sponge when I'm actually going to exfoliate my skin with an exfoliator. So for instance, this, um, oops, this Timmy Blends, my favorite, favorite, favorite facial scrub. This right here. If I'm going to use this, I'm not going to use this to wash my face because I feel like this like that's just too much you know going on I feel like it'll be too too much on my skin too harsh on my skin so tonight I'm not exfoliating I'm just washing my face moisturizing and that's it so um yeah you're supposed to throw these out like every 30 days or so so 
that's that. Now I'm just gonna rinse my face. Oh, I did plug in my, um, hopefully y'all can hear me with this water going. I plugged in my steamer, because I wanna steam my face tonight. I steamed it the day before yesterday, and I try not to steam every single night. Next thing I do is tone the skin. So I'm gonna use my current favorite toner. You guys have heard me talk about this a million and one times. It's the Freck Beauty Cactus Water Lactic Acid Toner. This is a brand new bottle. I already emptied the other one. I had to get, um, get another one because I love it so freaking much. And I use these, um, let me show you, these little cotton pads. These are from Shiseido. And I got this little um, glass from Amazon, but I just take a little bit of this on the cotton pad and then I just take it around my face, just like this. Mm. Love how this smells. And while I do that, I'll get the steamer back on my face and just let it in the face a little bit more now what I'm gonna do is um, make sure my face is dry enough I'm gonna turn this off I don't need any more of that um, I'm just gonna make sure my face is dry enough kind of fan it a little bit um, yeah so now let me show you I am gonna use my Curology this is the treatment cream, and then this is the moisturizer. I get the moisturizer, the treatment cream, the um, cleanser, and the uh, body wash, which I still have not even used because I wanted to try it out. It's um, it's a good wash for like back knee if you get back knee. Um, but anyway, treatment cream goes first. This is what I've been using for years now. I've been on this for what? I always forget how many years I've been on this, but it's been a good minute. Um, and you guys told me about this back in, I want to say three years ago for it. Oh, girl, I don't forget, but um, you guys told me about Curology and I have been on it since then. And I've actually have um, worked with Curology a couple of times after me using it for a good minute, but I just take a couple of pumps and I put it on my face I try not to get the treatment cream near my eyes I just put it where I need it especially up here on the forehead and then around the perimeter of my face just like that so staying away from the eye area I'm gonna be using an eye cream y'all I have been using the mess and y'all know i've never been like the biggest fan of eye creams because honestly i don't know i just always felt like eye creams wasn't needed for me but um now i use them like crazy and the one i've been using recently is this uh fresh beauty lotus youth preserve eye cream we are almost out y'all i use this every single night ever since they sent this to me I've been using it religiously, so that rhymed. <laughs> so now I go in with the eye cream and I take a little bit of it under my eyes. I probably went in with too much, but I will blend it out. I just take it on my fingers like this. And this is just going to help, you know, keep the eyes hydrated all throughout the night you know keep me looking young even though I look like I'm 12 years old anyway <laughs> y'all I have a baby face like this runs in the family <laughs> it runs in the family I am in my 30s but I look every bit of I'd say I look I'd say, okay, I'm not going to say 12 because it's like super duper dramatic, but I'd say I look, uh, maybe 21, 
22, I'd say. Maybe not even my 20s, maybe like 17, 18, especially without makeup. I look like I have a straight up baby face. Um, anyway, now that the eye cream is on, this is when I go in with my Curel. Now I know it may seem like a lot of steps, but trust me y'all, I used to use so many products at night because I just love, 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 love doing skincare. Like it's just so therapeutic to me and I love like, products i love using products but cleanser toner moisturizer and a night cream and that's it i don't even have to use a night cream i can just settle with this curology moisturizer and be good but and notice i'm not putting the moisturizer around my eye area because i already put on eye cream but this is all i do this is all I have been doing. Now, if I am gonna try new products, I gradually put them in my skincare routine. Like, I don't go crazy with it. Like, say if I have, I don't know, a new cleanser, a new moisturizer, a new, I don't know, eye cream, a new um, exfoliator, I don't use all of the new products at once. I just slowly put them in. So, with that being said, since I recently ran out of my, um, what was it, the fresh night cream that I just shared with you guys in my empties video, I have incorporated a new night cream in my skincare routine, which is this uh, Pharmacy Honey Halo Ultra Hydrating Ceramide Moisturizer. Now, I mean, this is a moisturizer, but I consider this, it's, definitely thicker than the Curology. This is literally like, this is so, it's water. <laughs> I mean, that's the first ingredient in this. It is literally like putting water on your face. Um, so I still like to go in with another, like a heavier moisturizer. And this stuff, wow, you guys, this stuff is thick and it literally reminds me of my, um, Pixi Rose Ceramide Moisturizer. Y'all remember that one? I used to talk about it all the time because it's so thick and it is so freaking moisturizing, y'all. So moisturizing to the point where when I wake up the next day, my face looks like, it still looks like I put on, it looks like I had just put on a moisturizer when I wake up. Like it doesn't look like my skin is dried out because this will girl this is good that's why i consider this my night cream because i wouldn't wear this in the daytime i mean i would but i honestly feel like this is best for me at night because it's so thick and it leaves the skin so freaking glowy and smooth i love it but that's all i do that is all i do for my skincare my night skincare routine um, I'll probably show you guys my morning. Yeah, that's what we'll do tomorrow. Since tomorrow's Sunday. I mean, I'm not doing anything tomorrow, but um, of course, uploading the vlog. But I just need to edit this part of the vlog in. Well, this part into the vlog. And then whatever I do tomorrow as far as like vlogging, I'll just edit that in and upload it for you guys. But yeah, I think that's what I'll do in the morning. I'll show you guys my quick morning routine. Um... I do have to work out like first thing in the morning. So I'll show you guys what I do to my face um, before I work out. Um, and then of course after, which is gonna be my morning routine, which is not like, it is like one to two steps. It's so simple, but that is all I do to my face y'all. Like that is it. I may put some stuff on my lips. I'm actually gonna do that now because they are pretty dry. I want to use, hmm, let's use this. I'm gonna use this. Ooh, please don't fall. <laughs> don't fall. I'm gonna use this little Fenty Beauty um, Pro Kisser Luscious Lip Balm. But yeah, girl, that is all I do with my nighttime skincare routine. Not much. If I have any new products, I actually have a couple of new products that I wanna um, try. So I'm gonna slowly, gradually put them in to my routine. But that's all I do. 
that is all I do. So right now it is time to go to bed. Hope you guys enjoyed my little night talk through skincare routine and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Happy Sunday y'all. It is Sunday. I'm feeling good. I already did my workout. I already bathed. I already just lotioned up my body, put my little loungewear set on that I got from Boohoo. Um, I told y'all last night that I was going to show you guys my quick morning routine. So I've already started. Um, well, earlier this morning before I even did my little workout, I just put on this on my face. I just rubbed this all over the face um, just to kind of clean it. It is a cleanser and I just do that first thing. <laughs> Um, and then after my workout, of course, you know, I bathe, wash my face. So I wash my face again with the Shani Darden, um, cleanser. I was going to do my Curology cleanser that I have right here, but I just decided to do the Shani Darden. Um, and that's all that I, I've done so far. So now I'm going to show you guys what I do next. Now that the face is dry, everything is, you know, ready for hydration. Let me wash my hands real quick. I'm always washing my hands. So, I'm going to show y'all how simple and quick my morning skincare routine is. So, like I said last night, I have been incorporating eye creams in my daily routine. So, morning times or for the daytime, I use this um, Ola Hammer Skin uh, Banana bright eye cream is the truth bright eye cream is it okay y'all see it whatever and i just put this under my eyes so i can look more awake i feel like i look more awake anyway but i don't know i've just been enjoying this little mini step in my routines just tap it under the eyes like so and I also take a little bit of it on top of my eyelids just all over to make my eyes look more brightened and just more awake and hydrated <laughs> and then after that I take my um, summer Fridays cloud do oil free moisturizer this is what I showed y'all in my favorites video recently I like using this because it's super super lightweight like almost like you're applying the um tatcha water cream if y'all have ever tried that really really lightweight and thin and hydrating and i also like to wear it under makeup if i'm gonna wear makeup i'm not wearing makeup today today we're just lounging around but yeah just apply it just like that bring it down my neck and then that is pretty much it oh let me put on i'm gonna put on my tula spf the protecting glow daily sunscreen gel i put this on like every day pretty much every single day because i just love it sometimes i don't even use the summer fridays i just go straight in with this but i don't know i just love me an extra dextra extra dextra <laughs> um hydrated face so we're just gonna rub this in have i been out of focus this whole time probably so but oh well oh well and that's it girl that is my morning skincare routine that is all that i do good for the day pop on something on the lips if I want to and that's it that's it oh y'all I got a new bronzer in the mail I'm gonna show y'all let me put something on my lips because it's a little dry I've been keeping this Fenty um clip dip what do they call this the dip clip gloss it's the Fenty glow I just keep it here in the bathroom because I mean I don't really use it use it but it's here if I want something, you know, cute on the lips to use with my fingers since my hands are already clean. I just keep it in here. But y'all, I got 
Um, I've been wanting, what is that? Oh, I've been wanting the Chanel cream bronzer for some years now, but y'all know they only had like one shade. But recently they came out, hold on. Recently they came out with a darker shade. So I ordered it and I just got it in the mail. So I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. And I'm thinking about, y'all, so I filmed, cause y'all know I have been on it with my bulk filming lately. One of the videos I filmed was my bronzer collection. Y'all, when I say that was, I think the last, yeah, it was the last video that I filmed on one day cause I was like filming all day and that was the very last video I filmed when I say I have to do it over because the mic was off so when I got done filming the video before that I turned everything off because I just didn't want it you know wasting battery and stuff like that but anyway um, and when I sat down to film I forgot to turn the freaking mic on and that video that well that footage is like maybe like an hour long so I was sitting there the whole time with the mic off. So I am gonna have to do it over, which is kind of good because I can include the one that I just got in the mail. But y'all, I'm so mad. So, so mad that I gotta film that over, but it's okay. It's whatever. It was an easy video to film anyway, but, um, but yeah, let me show you the bronzer. Let's go. Y'all look at the box. I'm gonna keep this box because it's just so cute. Look at her. I've already opened it, but I went ahead and got a couple of samples because I mean, it's Chanel, why not? <laughs> but this is the bronzer. The shade is Healthy Glow Bronze. What is it? Uh, deep Tan Bronze. Tell me why I feel like this may be, I don't know. Let's, let me put the camera down. I don't know y'all. I feel like this, because the color actually looks like my actual foundation color. So I don't know if, okay, here it is. Yes, they're cute. But I don't know if it's gonna really, you know, work on my complexion, but they did just bring it out and this is how it looks. I mean, does that not look like my foundation color? I don't know, we're gonna try it out for sure. Um, I don't know when I am going to be able to film the video since I'm, well, I probably can squeeze in the video this week, tomorrow. Yeah, so tomorrow's Monday. I probably can, so I don't want to swatch it just yet, but this is the color. Now it is looking a little bit lighter because I'm directly in front of the window, so the light is making it look a little bit lighter. But let me see if I can turn this down some. Mm. I don't know y'all, does it not look like my exact skin tone? I don't know if this is gonna bronze me up, but we will see, you guys will see for sure. But I'm excited to, you know, try it out. Ooh, hold on, let me turn this up some. I'm excited to try it out and let y'all know. So. Yeah, I just want to show y'all that. Oh, let me show you the samples that I got. I got them right here. So I got, I still haven't purchased this per, uh, particular perfume. It's the Coco Mad Mademoiselle, Mad Mademoiselle <laughs> um, perfume. I just got the little sample, but I do have the body wash and it smells really, really, really good. But I just wanna get the sample of that since it was free. And I also got the um, cleansing cream. It's cleansing cream to foam cleanser. Because this was free too. So, yas. Girl, come on, focus. I just want y'all to see the little bottle. Cute. But yeah, that's what I got. Little freebie. Cute little Chanel bag. Cute, cute, cute. Let me just make a cute little screenshot of this because this might be on the thumbnail of this vlog. Make a cute little screenshot. But yeah, here it is up close, closer so y'all can see the bronzer. Cute, cute, cute. 
Mm -mm -mm. Cute. I want the box to be a little bit closer like this. Maybe if I do this. Yeah, that might be cute right there. Take a little screenshot. That's how I do my thumbnails. Instead of taking actual pictures, I just take screenshots of the product or whatever is going to be in the vlog. Um, but yeah. All right, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me this week and a little bit last week. Um, I had fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you are subscribed because we upload three times on the channel. Sunday, Wednesday, and Fridays. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you have your notifications on. But that is it, girl. I'm going to relax the rest of the day. I'm going to upload this later on today. And I will see you guys later on this week. Bye.